Greetings everybody, I'm Elastis. Thank you for joining me and welcome back to European Science 4 playing as the Teutonic Order. So I've had a thought during videos and I went for administrative 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 yeah that's up it's Monday it's difficult because the the cheaper coin cost will be really nice and the mercenaries just make sense because we'll be murking up like hell to be able to defeat Poland again because <clears throat> uh, the less we rely on our allies the better <clears throat> alternatively we could try and become the papal controller uh, the uh, the Emperor I'll probably Yeah, it's very unlikely. I don't think we can even be a, uh, an emperor since we are a uh, monast monastic order. Probably can't. Yeah, it's probably what we can't. Yeah, let's just go with we can't. <coughs> okay, so we'll wait to recover some uh, manpower. <coughs> Sit on these provinces a bit. England, Munster. And I think, yeah, we need to expand either... Do you hate Poland yet? No, you love Poland. Yeah, maybe what we want to do... Fabricate on Riga and attack Riga to get just Poland in. And the Hansa. I'm not too scared of the Hansa. The Hansa has probably 12,000 men or so. Can field quite an army. Uh, military, the Hansa, 9,000, yeah. And the right. Total, yeah, 9,000. Okay, my Blaslau, okay. We scored stuff which we took from that other dude. View country, no, view him. Fabricate a claim. How rich is this? 11, hmm, probably give it to our vassal. Saxon is now an accepted culture. Nice. Which means, if we look at the culture map mode, we are Germanic Prussian. Yeah, we can just. Yeah, everything will be fine. Uh, actually. Yeah, we might convert this. When can we do this? Poland exists as a nation. Oh, okay, we have to uh, remove Poland. That sounds like a thing. This boat can go and help out. Um, um Novgorod. <clears throat> Is our mission still 31? Yep. Yeah. In Stettin, this is going to take forever to build. Wow. 664 days. I don't think so. I think we'll build another one. Another galley. Yo, how much done? 65? Yeah, it's just faster to build them in the proper provinces. Slop. Still the slowest. Okay. God's none. Yeah, it's fine. We'll refabricate on God's none and then... Letzika. We have a claim on 86. You, we don't have our building, fabricating one. 85. 80. Oh, okay, this one will last a while. Yeah, it's, it's these two we still need. Then we can go to war with Riga. I think if we attack, you are allied to Denmark, Mecklenburg, okay. So we might call in Bohemia for this. He probably would join against Riga. Do I add all this to the Empire? Yes. Very nice. Let's fabricate that last claim. 
but then oh, twelve more days and our mission should be good. Oh, we've enacted the first thing. Members get build cost minus five, demon cost minus five. Nice. Three. Morale of navies. Nice. Are we still making money? We're still making a little bit. Rival arrival, Novgorod. Novgorod is probably going to die pretty soon. I can imagine he has claims on some of it. What's his mission? Subjugate to Crimea. <clears throat> Are you winning your war? Yeah. Are Crimea light to Kazan? Yeah. Novgorod just doesn't feel like we should worry too much. We might actually. Oh, well, we can't fabricate on them. Have you fabricated on. No. Fabricated on uh, Gotland. Gotland. Oh, we need a shake-up. Okay. Ah, Byzantine refugees. My lord, Byzantium has fallen to the Sar Saracens, ish something. The last bastion of the Roman of the Roman Empire. The city of Constantine is now in Turkish hands. As Christendon reveals from the shock Byzantine refugees flock to the cities and courts of Europe, bringing with them old manuscripts of classical knowledge, tracts by Aristotle, Aristotle, Plato and Galen, and a thorough knowledge of both Latin and Greek. Inviting the refugees to the Teutonic Order might prove an enormous boost to our own efforts in the field of culture and science. Culture and science. So we could gain uh, technology cost minus 10 for 30 years, at the cost of admin and diplo, or we can say, bugger off. Mm -hmm. 30 years, we'll be able to take up a couple of times. Yeah, it's, it's worth it. I believe it is. Ooh. Yeah, aggressive expansion. Not great. Never claim on Riga. Very good. Riga, you're so allied to useless people. Are you so a center of interest? Yes, you should be. <clears throat> I'll just do this one again, even if we fail it. We're still uh, a way off covering man power. Oh, he just teched up. Or switch unit types. Mm. We do have a free diplomat. Let's see, if we attacked Riga, who would come? Oh, Austria. Austria could definitely. Bohemia. Bohemia would probably help out more against Poland. Although I'd rather. Yeah, I should call Bohemia in because Austria can help out against other em Empress things. But, um, yeah, let's see. Poland. Poland has 28,000 men, yeah, so he has... Oh, we actually have more than him. Interesting. Stettin, why are you so upset? Oh, yeah, we had that event with... Uh, that court fabricating where we have local something. Okay, we have a bit of uh, revolt risk here, but they shouldn't. Washington, maybe we can move some men up. You have 3.5. Yeah, 5.5 to to. Okay, so these armies are 9 to 10 to. Attach the uh, mercenaries and bring them over here. So lots of mercenaries. Nine two five two. Let's merge and split. Whoop. No. Gah. Oh, you still have mercenaries. <clears throat> Six 
7262. Okay, so um, an ar army at the moment is mostly mercenaries. Probably have too many foot soldiers, which we can disband. And a free guy, he's not doing anything useful. Anything else we can fabricate on? No. So we'll continue on Lithuania. We might increase autonomy on, let's see, zero, zero. Is there anywhere we can decrease? Berlin. Stanberg, no. Kolberg. This thing, Stalglapodal. You can only 91, so another 10 years, okay. Sing here, no, this is all too recent. Yeah, I need to have at least 5,000 manpower. And then I think we can go to war with our northern neighbours. Northern neighbours? Let's see, can we build this up? Ah, yeah, in Potsdam. Yes, please. And... In... I guess this province. An extra nearly a thousand will be nice. How many points are we generating? 999. Nine. Very nice. Didn't we have focus a while back? Did we lose it? Hmm. Well, 999 nine, nine is nice. I will not complain. We'll complain that we have so many... How many shall we pay for these mercenaries? Probably more than our normal troops. Mercenaries... Over force limits. Oh. Okay, then we'll disband a couple more mercs. So one over. That's why we're not making any money. That's why we also have more troops than uh, Poland. Okay, I'd rather be... Oh, yeah. This is very nice. This is what I like to see. Six ducats. We'll need... Ooh. Yes, please. Mercenary cost. And we'll kind of uh, scale back on taking too much land until we have the next idea. So we might just feed a uh, vassal here. I wish you would fabricate some claims on Novgorod or Sweden or something. Sweden? Ooh, you like us. Ah, oh, he's allied to Lithuania again. Okay. So, yeah. Let's let our manpower recover. How many men can we have? Some guy died. Ooh, we have an extra colonel. Nice. Which means we'll probably use it to go... Well, cantalism. Might... Uh, we need an unrest guy, which isn't available. So... We'll go for the yearly... Um... We'll go for the inflation reduction guy. Might as well. We have one. Lowered by 0.1 a year. So, yeah, let's, uh... Okay, then we have 12.
Yeah, I don't think I like stability. I no. If we're going to at war, let's keep it and use it to do. Uh, Poland is fabricating, which means they think they can beat us. Which with Lithuania and Denmark, they probably can. Lithuania, how many troops do you now have? Lithuania, Lithuania. 23, so that's all your men, roughly. There's one guy just recruited, which is walking around somewhere. In Poland? Poland is a 28. Fabricate on Vilnius. Yes, please. And let's fabricate on... Um, this guy. Hey, yeah. Fabricate on Brandenburg. A good old buddy. Old buddy, old pal. Yeah, this has gone very... We've been at peace for so long. Probably been at peace for two episodes soon. Yep. But we, we do need to... Bleh. Stettin. I have men here. Why is there so much unrest? Oh, I think I just lowered it last time. I'm also very tempted to lower it here. But that would be... Kind of annoying to manage. We'll have Brandenburgian separatists very soon. Potsdam, Rupin, and Ogermark. <clears throat> yeah, we'll wait for those rebels to spawn. Continue fabricating claims. So, a very relaxed episode. I don't want to rush into uh, to war here. Riga shouldn't get any powerful allies. <clears throat> and then... Poland, we won't take any land, we'll just break their lines with people. Like, if we can get to uh, him... Ah, oh, damn it. Poland, why do you keep allying these two men? Uh, if we can break their lines and break Denmark's alliance, and then support Sweden and then just fight Denmark, we'll have... Uh, devotion gives me... I can lose some devotion. I'm still gaining. Oh, national tax modifier went 25 to 20. Okay, I didn't expect the jump to be that, that big. It's fine. I'm considering moving a bit some of these forts around because they are redundant. Where do we have forts? Especially here, which isn't a great province. Hmm. Tech. Do we want to take the next new tech idea? Yeah, we're ten years ahead, so let's get ship du durability. And then we'll get soon. When do we get the next idea? In 85. So another three years. And then we can... Uh... You know what? Let's uh, focus, because our next ruler will be absolute rubbish at admin. With one four four. Yeah. How many year every? How many years do we have an election? Okay, we're in court. Our elections are every I don't know <laughs> I'll have to look it up uh, from the feel of it it's every eight or so years maybe nine okay we now have a claim on villainous and on outmark Let's continue fabricating claims on our rival, Lithuania. And on... I still allied to Poland. Poland, Poland. 28,000 men with 21,000 manpower. You 
are involved in no war. <clears throat> I'm tempted to just call both of them in. Yeah, you know what? Do we want to co belligerent Poland? No, he'll just call Lithuanian Denmark and Sweden and stuff. Okay. So this is clearly overkill. Ah. Of my rebels. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll just see next time, on the next episode, what we decide to do. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please consider the like button and post comment ideas and suggestions in the comment section. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.